welcome to the first night of Vlogica, where I vlog the eight nights of Hanukkah from here in Japan. Yeah. It is the first night of Hanukkah, and it is also Christmas Eve. But first, first things first, I gotta get some coffee. Yeah, and some lunch. Unfortunately, they were sold out of the gingerbread latte, so my basic self is, is very sad, but that's kind of silly. So I got a cafe mocha with lots of espresso. It makes my head feel nice. And I got a holiday chicken sandwich and this chocolate pudding. It's so cute. This is kind of like a limited time thing in Starbucks, so we're going to try it and see if it reminds us of home. And I don't know, do you guys have this here? It's so cute, it looks like the little cup. Alright, let's beat up this pudding. Oh, this does not look like pudding. This looks kind of like vanilla. And Jason, you're right, it does kind of look like something you get at Lush. Let's try it. You said as a face mask. Tastes good though. I should give a little disclaimer that um, just wanted to let you know that uh, Jason had some sad news this week that um, there was a loss in his family. So I'm not sure how much he's going to be on Vlogica and I am not going to force him to be in the videos at all or even ask him because I just want to respect his privacy. If he decides to be on, that's cool. I think he's doing fine, so not to worry. But um, yeah, we're kind of laying low this this holiday season. So, but we'll still be doing some cool stuff. Unfortunate name. Mm. Jason noticed that these soaps were made in Aleppo. In Syria. Mm. Rock soap? Mm, just soap, but it looks pretty cool. Mm. It's Kelly! It's Kelly! Ah, uh, it was Kelly. Strawberry mochi. She is beautiful model. Got all kinds of other masks. Could be a minion. This is skin cream, and it's like a super awesome lotion. I was developed in the UK and Japan and they make great gifts because they come in these really cute little tins that are constantly they're constantly changing them up. They like Disney collaborations and whatnot. But yeah, it like hella works. Mm. So these are my paws. My dry paws. I'll put on one. You can see the difference. Of course, it's gonna be like wet, but yeah. Look at the difference. Like up here, I did like some swatches over here earlier, so <laughs> that's why there's marks on them. Ah, it smells so good too. So if you're looking for a gift while you're here in Japan, I like to get these because you can't really find them, especially in the States. They're pretty reasonable and um, I just love these. They work for dudes too. Dudes get dry skin too. What does Pikachu have here? This looks like a beer. <laughs> All this Pika stuff. 
just like a little mini gallery of some pictures of Mount Scuba. There's two peaks to Mount Scuba. There's the dude peak and the chick peak. Yeah. And so there's a shrine up there, um, which is really good for all things related to uh, marriage and finding a partner and childbirth and parenting and that kind of stuff. Fertility. Lush closed! I can't believe it! That's kind of why I wanted to come out here was to get some stuff from there, but oh well. Uh, find other stuff to do. Yeah, see, it's super busy tonight. Um, yeah, I don't know if we're gonna go to Kentucky this year. I think we might just go to the convenience store to get chicken because a lot of this is for reservations. That's the line for. get a Christmas apple for 10 bucks, but it's half price. That's so cool. I wonder how they did that. Merry Christmas. Might as well enjoy washing dishes. Yeah. California, many Americans see the Golden State as an ideal resort destination. What are they sea basing over there? Oh my goodness. We're in the Maiden Scuba store in the station area. And look, there's your tea. We're gonna have cookies shaped like Mount Scuba. Cute. These are the 7 Eleven Christmas cakes. We didn't order one this year. We didn't order it from uh, Magnolia. Just because it was kind of too much trouble this year and they're really expensive and we hope to go out there and grab some cupcakes fresh anyway at some point. So we're selecting right now. Yeah. We have stuff to eat at home too and I might make a pumpkin pie uh, probably tomorrow. So we're we'll that too. Here's some more options. Hi, Mario. I like it, girl. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What's that? I got some chicken. My Ninja. I like it, girl. Hi, what is that? What is that? <gasps> Mommy John. Do you like chicken? Oh my goodness. Oh. That's about as vocal as she gets. <laughs> she loves Jason. Yeah. So much. So much. Hi. Oh, stretch. Oh, stretch. Hi, good girl. Hi, you look so radiant on that rug. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What do you have to say? What's going on? Oh, she went to Cute. Notice me. So good. Yet done it? Have you been picking around these gifts, Monachan? Because they are out a little bit. Mm. These are not all of our presents, but all the presents over there. Yeah, the blue ones are mostly from Ma. She hooked us up. And there's Mina Jen. She's such a good girl. You're so excited. And then under the tree, we have more. Yeah. She's excited about because there's one for her under there. You're blocking my shot, Mo. And there's more up there. Yeah. With an electric menorah. Mine again. Do you like 
Do you like cookies? Would you like me to give you a cookie? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Come here. I'm gonna sit. Good girl. Good girl. She's so dainty. I got a box from iHerb or iHerb, however you say it. And look at this is cute. This little box lining. Mana loves opening boxes and presents. What are you doing? You're so funny. Can I open it? Let me show you what I got. I got it. I had to do it. I had to do it. Look, they said, it's peanut butter, pumpkin spice flavor peanut butter. Oh. <laughs> you should have seen the look on his face. He just cringed so bad. And I got some basil and uh, some pumpkin mix. Yeah, because I'm going to make some pumpkin pie. And I got a few um, supplements as well. Okay, this says bake with me. Try me with apples. Blend me into smoothies. <laughs> Are these peanuts or like little pineapples? Maybe with real pumpkin. All right, I'm joined by my sweetie, and we're gonna light the menorah. And for those of you guys who don't know, this is our little mini menorah. Um, I grew up Jewish; he did not, so this is his little cultural experience. <laughs> and he was having another cultural experience. He was playing Final Fantasy, which you can see on the TV behind yeah. you. <laughs> And uh, we got the new Dragon Quest Builders. It just came today, so I am so excited to play this. I was playing the um, Taikin Bun, the trial version, so we bought it. But anyway, um, to light Mine the menorah. Here too. <laughs> Hi, Mana. So to light the menorah, tonight is the first night. There are eight nights of Hanukkah, um, so the middle candle is just used to light the other uh, eight nights. So tomorrow there will be two candles plus the middle candle, and then the next night there will be three plus the middle, and so on. And to commemorate a miracle that happened. They only had enough lights, or they only had enough oil way back in the day for like a few days, but it ended up lasting for eight crazy nights. So that's why we celebrate this festival of lights. Yeah. All right, so here we go. And we say, Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech alam asher kideshanu b'mitzvotav v'tzivanu l'hadot mer shal chanukah. Yay! And then we open Happy presents. My mom actually made this drip tray. It's so cute. She painted it. She's so good. Thanks, Ma. I won't really uh, say what our Hanukkah presents were because Jason and I are kind of having a little, you know, our Hanukkah. But I can show you Mana's present. She's very excited about it. <laughs> She's wagging her tail. Can you open it yourself? Oh my goodness, what if I get it started? <laughs> Can you get it? What is it? Oh my goodness. Oh, you got a heart toy. I actually meant to give that to her for Valentine's Day, but oh. I forgot. So now it is a Christmas present. And I gotta take the tags off. It squeaks. It squeaks. Where's the squeaker? She's looking for it. There it is. Oh my goodness. This is our feast. Not bad for a convenience store. And that chicken is really good. We've had it before. So good. Something that I've been doing in Vlogicas in the past is uh, introducing hidden gems. So these are channels, um, or not necessarily just YouTube channels anymore, but things that I think are very much underrated and maybe they just haven't really gotten discovered uh, as they should be. Um, the first one, which doesn't have nearly as many views as I think it should, is Molly's Christmas collaboration, which he just put up today. And yours truly might be in there too. Uh, but yeah, Molly is awesome. And of course, go check out his channel too. But um, the Christmas collaboration is always a lot of fun, and thank you, Molly, for including me. The first of my hidden gems is Ramen Quest. She is adorable, and I love her voice, and I hope that she considers voice acting. Check her out. She's so cute. Do, 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 do. It's a vlog. <laughs> That's so cute. 
So go check her out. I love uh, her videos. They are so much fun. The next channel that I hope that you guys will check out and subscribe to is by Guy Jillionaire, and he has the best name that is on YouTube. Uh, it's a mix of Gaijin and Millionaire, of course. Um, I guess you can't really see his symbol, but um, his channel is really good. So he has a lot of gaming related stuff. Um, he also has some really cool Japan stuff like Kit Kats. And um, you might even see a little snippet of one of my videos in there as well. Yeah, so Guy Jillionaire is awesome. He is a wonderful person in real life too. So please go check him out. I do want to throw in my channels too, just so you guys know and just so you have an update on what's going on with Japanese IRL. Uh, Japanese IRL is my other channel where I talk about words and phrases in Japanese that come up in real life. And it is on hiatus right now because there's a problem with my channel, so until that gets resolved, um, I really want to wait until people will be able to see my videos that are subscribed to it. So um, there's still a lot of great stuff, so I hope that you'll check it out and I hope that you'll subscribe to it so then when we're back in business then you'll get updates about it. The newest thing that I'm doing is on Twitch. I have started Twitch and I guess you can't really see it, um, but I have started this for my gaming endeavors and I really like the live stream interface. Uh, I also like uh, for IRLs, so I do a lot of walking around the, the Tokyos and I use my handy dandy iPhone and I do IRL streams and I've just started and I love it because I don't have to edit anything so please go and check those two channels out as well. Thank you! Alright so that is gonna do it for this evening's vlog and I hope that you guys have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy Hanukkah and this is so sweet look what our neighbors uh, hung on our door and like a little stocking for Monichan so she could have this on her collar too. Yeah, that was so sweet of them and it was attached to our door. Such a nice little present. Uh, so Jason and I are going to finish out Christmas Eve. There might be some more presents involved. I'm not sure. So that'll be fun and we will probably wake up for Christmas. And I'm not sure if we'll vlog Christmas, but definitely some Hanukkah goodness and some good stuff tomorrow. So I will see you tomorrow. Merry Christmas! Happy Hanukkah! Merry everything! Okay, I guess I can show you this. So this is what I got Jason. He loves tea. Mm, thank you. This is awesome tea. It's white Christmas tea. And so it's a black tea. It has kind of a little bit of a chocolate mm. flavor. It's the mm. highest quality teas. Yeah. Mm, look at that cute wrapper. Yeah. Merry goody! Oh my god, I just to show you what Jason got me for Christmas! Mm -hmm. Oh my god!